Now at 530, a CBS 4 News safety alert and police arrest the woman accused of making threatening phone call to a high school in Fort Lauderdale. Police say the 51 year old mother called St. Thomas Aquinas High School last month, threatening to blow it up and kill the principal. CBS 4's Peter Dench joins us live from the Broward Jail, where she is now being held. Peter. Well, Jim and Ruta Bay, there are indeed some damaging allegations right here in this arrest report. Now, Nancy Kramer is charged with making a bomb threat, a second degree felony. And we also learned in court that she has been arrested before. Nancy Kramer, we are before the court this morning for threat to throw or place or discharge a destructive device. And I find probable cause. 51-year-old Nancy Kramer is charged with making those threats against St. Thomas Aquinas High School starting August 28th. The state would be asking for a bond in the amount of $100,000 based upon the facts of the case. The defendant made repeated threats to blow up the school and also made a threat to kill the principal. Fort Lauderdale police say employees here were able to easily identify the caller as Kramer because her name and number showed up on the caller ID and she also identified herself as well. An arrest report says Kramer gave intimate knowledge of her child, also made a statement she paid $11,000 in full to the school for her daughter's tuition. This information was true. On August 30th, police say they were called to the school about Kramer harassing staff. And when an officer tried to reason with her in a phone call, she became irate. In court, we learned Kramer had been previously out on bond after being charged with battery in a firefighter a month ago, to which her attorney says... We're talking about a, a, a slight shoulder slap. Which her attorney argues for a much lower bond. I do not believe my client's a threat. She doesn't own any firearms. There's no uh, devices or anything that she maintains. In a statement, St. Thomas Aquinas principal Denise Saloma says at no time was the safety of our students, faculty, staff, and campus ever in jeopardy or compromised. But the judge is concerned. In the day and time that we live in, these are serious, very serious threats. And so um, uh, I, this time I am going to impose a $50,000 bond. And Kramer is ordered to stay away from the school and responds. Right. Yes, Your Honor, I understand. And that means that Kramer is to have no contact whatsoever with anyone who works at the school or who is a student there. At this point, it is not known what prompted the threats. We're live in Fort Lauderdale. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News. Peter, thanks much.